Winter Storm Elliot. Man, 30 to 40 mile an hour sustained winds, wind gusts up to 50, 30 below zero wind chills. You know, whether you're at home or if you're out extreme weather camping like I am, you've got to be prepared. You have to have a preparedness plan. You have to know what to do and how to do it and importantly, when to do it. Get in out of this mess. Much better in here. some of these layers off. Now, speaking of being prepared, I want to show you guys something. This is the perfect time to talk about these bad boys right here. You know, with this freezing 30 below zero wind chills 50 mile an hour wind gusts there is a good chance that even if you're at home there's going to be power outages and the ability for someone to get to you if you need help it is kind of slim a lot of you guys know my history 38 years on the street as a paramedic taught paramedic science in the college a company reached out to me rugged <laughs> I remember it as effing rugged frugged they said Keith we're starting a new product would if we sent you some of our equipment would you take a look at it and give us your honest opinion <laughs> you know me I couldn't resist that one so I said sure and I took a look at this and I instantly said, man, this stuff is good. Guys, this is high quality, high quality first aid kits and survival equipment that the normal everyday person can afford. It doesn't have all the foo-foo, all the things you don't need. It just has the necessary equipment at a good price, easily restockable. They just started their crowd share program. It went active Monday. I'm going to put all the information in the description. I'm not even going to try to show you everything, but we are going to take a look at it. Let's start with the base camp. Comes in this super rugged military grade box. And it basically has Everything that you're going to need at your home, here in the van, and, you know, that's why they call it the base camp. It has basically all the equipment, as a matter of fact, short of my monitor and my drug box, I could have taken care of about 90% of everything I did on the ambulance with those three things. This, this box with its equipment, a monitor and a drug box, I'd have been good to go. That's how well thought out, well stocked this thing is. Tourniquet, gloves. It even has a first aid guidebook. For those of you that, that aren't paramedics or nurses, you know, it gives you a step-by-step -step of how to take care of things. Scissors, bandages, gloves. And these things, these are special. This is the wound care pack. It is absolutely loaded with all the essential stuff to take care of any type of wound. Even has blister packs in it. 
for those of us that like to camp and walk too much and get the blisters. Most of you have been there. You know what I'm talking about. Easily resealable. And the neat thing is, when you buy this, they track it. And when your stuff starts to expire, they get in contact with you and they say, hey, stuff is starting to expire. Do you want to restock? Also, if you use things, you can buy smaller quantities to restock these. I'm telling you guys, this stuff has been well thought out. This is their medication pack. It is loaded with ibuprofen, Tylenol, uh, nausea medicine, uh, all kinds of over-the-counter stuff. You don't have to have a prescription. This is what they call their environmental pack. This thing has sunscreen. Let me just see here. Burn cream, sting relief wipes, hydrocortisone, uh, triple antibiotic, sunscreen. I think I already said that. It even has eye wash. Let me show you this thing. There's a couple of them in here. Look at that. Twist that off and rinse your eye out. This is like Christmas early for me. Yeah. Look at this. Tape. Tourniquets. Uh, burn sheet. I mean, it, guys, this thing's... Wow. So... Like I said, for at home, business, your shop, your van, this is a great kit. Now, for hiking, day hiking, backpacking, car camping, truck camping, you don't want this big one. They make a smaller version that also has a couple of items that are good for survival on the trail. That's their trailhead. Lightweight, great pack. Has a place that fits right on your belt, and then you can take it right off if you need to. Put it on the ground, open it up. I love this thing. This is cool kind of a just a little bit bigger version of the other one but it has some extra things and those are right here let me show you emergency whistle tweezers signaling mirror tick remover compass shears a fire steel emergency blanket it even has one of those emergency shelters compression galls it even has a non-occlusive bandage, which is designed for sucking chest wounds. That's where, if there's a hunting accident and they're shot, you have to put that over it so that a person can uh, survive long enough for the ambulance to get there and for them to get them to surgery. Like I said, nice. All right. It's a thing called Indiegogo. It's their crowd share. We'll put all the information in the description. It started Monday. Check it out, guys. Take a look at it because it's, it's priced at a great price. It's high quality. There's no foo-foo in this. It's just stuff you need. Yeah, I'm pretty impressed with it. I know I'm going to get me some. And uh, hope to see you on the trail. Be safe out there. Stay warm during this storm. Keep your family safe. We'll see you on the next one. Later.